This book is for leaders who spent most of their time in their core circle, where they have authority and where they're in control, or relative control, and they, they are in the authority, they know what they're doing. And on the whole, they begin to realise that they have to be able to operate outside the division that they run and take responsibility for the whole organisation, for problems that are other than their own. Um, and not only do they need to, to move into this first circle of the whole organisation, then they begin to realise they need to move into an even greater circle of the whole of society because no organisation is an, is, is an island entire of itself. It has to be able to, to, to link with the outer world. But to be able to lead outside your own circle and your own authority, you have to learn to lead where you haven't got authority. And that, in many cases, is a very different experience where you can't tell anybody what to do. And you have to learn to build consensus, build coalitions. You have to be able to understand about a different kind of time frame and to build your own leg legitimacy to actually operate in the outer circles. I, I'm passionate about this subject because I run an organisation called Common Purpose, which, which is devoted to developing leaders who can lead in the outer circle and who can stand out as leaders even if they're, own, they're not actually in their own core. Um, the book, I hope, has stolen the knowledge of masses and masses of people who certainly I've watched over the years, both getting it right and getting it thunderously wrong and sometimes getting so angry they sort of revert back into their own circle saying nothing can ever be achieved out there. But it isn't true. There are ways of figuring out how to, how to lead when you haven't got any authority. And this is book is capturing that knowledge so that you can be more effective both as a professional and as a citizen.